Welcome to Bogota, Colombia, a city full of history, culture, and some of the friendliest people you'll ever meet. Today, we will take a quick look at seven spots you must visit. Let's go. We're kicking things off at the heart of Bogota, Plaza de Bolivar. It's a bustling square surrounded by some of the city's most important buildings. You've got the Capitolia, the Cathedral, and a whole lot of pigeons. Seriously, those pigeons own the place. A perfect spot for people watching and bird dodging. Voy a cantar esta canción con mucho cariño de mi corazón a la República Dominicana. Next up, Museo Militar. The military museum where I was not allowed to film. Yeah, just pictures. But hey, it's packed with cool stuff like uniforms, weapons, and some intense battle history. Even if you're not a history enthusiast, you'll appreciate the friendly staff and free entry. <laughs> From there, it's a quick walk to La Candelaria, the oldest neighborhood in the city. This place is like Bogota's beating heart. Colorful streets, colonial buildings, and street art that makes Instagram scream with envy. Don't be surprised if you fall in love with the vibe and spend hours just wondering. Dominicana, la casa del merengue, la casa de la bachata. La, 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 la. La casa del merengue, la 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 la, y la casa de la bachata. Next up is the Museo de Bogotá, just around the corner from La Candelaria. This museum dives deep into the city's history, giving you a sense of how Bogotá has evolved. It's small but mighty, just like me. Wait, I mean, just like it. Anyway, it's free, so there's no reason not to pop in. Right near the Museo de Bogotá, you'll find a hidden gem, Handicrafts Artesanias Souvenirs. It's cozy, filled with authentic Colombian souvenirs and staff. Super friendly, perfect for grabbing gifts that aren't just fridge magnets. By the way, all these spots I've shown so far are super close to each other. You could probably throw a rock from one to the next, but don't actually throw rocks. That's frowned upon. cantar esta canción con mucho cariño de mi corazón Our next stop is Museo Botero dedicated to Colombia's most famous artist Fernando Botero <laughs> You've seen his art before you know the big bird round people and animals It's free it's fun and it's quirky a definite must see for art lovers and anyone who's ever thought what if I looked just a bit rounder Last but not least, the famous Museo del Oro. Unlike other museums, this one isn't free. It's a cost you a whopping 5,000 Colombian pesos. That's like $1.20. So really, no complaints. But pro tip, Sundays, totally free. It's home to the largest collection of gold artifacts in the world. So trust me, it's worth every peso. Pública, Dominicana, la casa del merengue, la casa de la bachata. Voy a cantar esta canción. And there you have it. All of this can be done in just a few hours, leaving you plenty of time to enjoy a good Colombian coffee or three. So if you're considering visiting Bogota, Colombia, you should definitely visit. If you like this video, hit that like button, share it with your travel buddies, and don't forget to subscribe. Have any questions? Drop them in the comments below. 
and I'll get back to you. Until next time, hasta luego. Cariño de mi corazón a la República Dominicana, la casa del merengue, la casa de la bachata. La...